everyone i am here to share some facts concerning ayurvedic proprietary medicines needs and challenges so to understand apm firstly we shall know what is proprietary or patent medicine which can be described as a medicinal compound with its formula preparations and other factors owned by an individual or a company with a trademark so now understanding what is apm which is ayurvedic proprietary medicine it can be understood as any of the medicinal formulations or a dosage form prepared and manufactured by a company with ingredients of the classical references but uh, with or without the uh, following the ayurvedic principles now moving on with the needs Firstly, it would be for preparation of newer formulations for newer diseases. For an example, as we all know, we are currently stuck in a pandemic situation, for which an exact cure has not yet been found, or the treatment protocol which exists will actually have side effects in the near future. So, it becomes necessary for our science, which has the main motto of Swasthya Swasthya Rakshanam, Aturasya Vikara Prashamanam. which means protecting the health of an healthy individual or and curing the disease of the deceased person ayurveda to merge with the modern researches and pharmacology and come up with a treatment modality for newer diseases second need would be due to the unavailability of the drugs mentioned in the classics it is uh, difficult for in present era to find any drug those are mentioned in the classics because most of them are maybe controversial or either extinct at this present time so by uh, mean of so by means of ayurvedic proprietary medicine we can actually come up with the drugs which are having similar properties to those mentioned in the classics and which will uh, produce similar effects as that of the formulations mentioned in the ayurvedic texts thirdly uh, speaking about proprietary medicine it has a uh, edge over traditional ones by masking the taste and improving the palatability most of the ayurvedic formulations are either bitter tasting or not palatable so by for an example of proprietary medicine used in this way uh, a syrup can be prepared instead of vata by adding any of the sweetening agents to actually mask the bitter taste and for easy palatability with these needs also comes challenges like most of major pharmacies do not follow ayurvedic principles in preparing and marketing the formulation validated protocol cannot be followed in most of the ayurvedic formulations as all of them were mentioned in thousands of years ago third challenge would be limited evaluation of drug to drug interaction in a proprietary medicine fourth challenge would be additives and preservatives added to these kinds of medicines can actually alter the pharmacological effect of the drug the most common challenge is lack of trust of uh, consumers on ayurvedic medicines This was all about needs and challenges of Ayurvedic proprietary medicine as per my knowledge